In today's video, we have new info on Season 5 from Leak Files, including what new weapons to expect to see, a new feature that you might be familiar with if you've played Apex Legends or CSGO, plus what's coming to the game this week. First, if you're like me and hate to watch 10 minute videos and just want straight to the point updates and info, then please support my channel by watching the video until the end and liking and commenting. This lets the YouTube bots know that while the video is shorter, it is worth promoting alongside those much longer videos. Let's jump into it. Number one, a new file leak gives us a preview of one, maybe two upcoming sniper rifles for season five. Twitter user BKTour shared leak game files seen here that mention the Remington 700 a real-life sniper rifle and one seen previously in Call of Duty like the original Modern Warfare. The next file is an image, but it's a picture of the Chaytac M200 Intervention. Again, a weapon seen in previous Modern Warfare titles. Right now it's unclear though if one or both weapons are coming to the game, but the game files are definitely in the game after the Season 4 update, mentioning both weapons. The next leak file come from Countryman Gaming shows us again the Remington 700 plus the AN94 that was last seen in Black Ops 2. So three potential new guns coming to the game from League Game Files, and that fits perfectly with how seasons usually progress. Two new weapons for the battle pass when the season launches, and one to be added in the mid-season update. Number two, if you like to admire your weapon blueprints, then you're in luck as new leaked animations are now showcasing a weapon in spec feature. Thanks to Countryman Gaming again and the football chank who made the video on Maya, you can now see the upcoming animations for the MP5, the Grout and Ram 7. Knowing Activision though, these will probably be sold individually rather than given to us free. Number three, if you didn't already know, in Warzone after the latest update, counter UAVs have been added but they require you to activate four UAVs at once, costing around $16,000. However, a new image shows the counter UAV could be in the game after the next update at the buy station for the low price of $500, and this could be a very big change to the meta. Better players and teams can often afford to have a constant UAV active and hunt down other players in game. This can give the average player more of a chance and we do know Infinity Ward want to make the game as fair as possible for average players so as not to drive them away. Finally, number four, this week coming to the game, you will see the return of Gunfight Tournaments, the 2v2 mode, a new playlist called the Bomb Plant Mosh Pit and another one called Realism Gun Game. New bundles, the Sari Kit Plunder Player Store bundle that includes this awesome Alabaster skin, the Blood in the Water that includes the Feeding Frenzy Shotgun skin, and for Warzone this week there are no plan changes as the 200 player squads is here to stay for the time being. Guys, that is a breakdown of everything we know about Season 5 leaks so far and also what's coming to the game this week. If you have any questions about any of the changes, feel free to ask them in the comments below. Remember to like and share the video so YouTube can't suggest this video to others, and thanks for watching.